So the Girls Geared for Engineering camp was specifically targeted at middle school girls, uh, just because a lot of research has shown that they'll be strong and passionate about STEM fields at that time, and then they start to drop off in the high school year. So we kind of wanted to pique their interest at that time. In addition to, we have our aviation camps for high school kids, so we thought if we get them involved and excited in middle school and engineering, perhaps they'll want to continue on at the high school level as well in the camps that we already offer. We marketed it or we designed it um, according to the two strengths we have within the college, um, aerospace engineering and aeronautics on the one hand, and then the other one would be the applied engineering fields. So most of the activities surrounded those two fields. I was able to program the computer to turn on the switches. It was really fun to like know how to program stuff because like it made me feel smart. It was really fun. We did lots of engineering work and we just built stuff and we sort of got to see all of the different types of engineering. We didn't just do one. And in one place we got to watch how different planes were made. So we got to see these machines working and how they made the stuff to go in them and how each part mattered. I didn't learn as much as I'd like to in my science class this year, I think. And so it was fun for me to get a chance to um, learn more over the summer. I really enjoyed a lot of parts, but I especially enjoyed computer assisted design, CAD. We did a rocket launch, so they built their own rocket to kind of tie into the space portion of our aerospace engineering program. They launched the rocket, of course. I thought that building the rockets was pretty fun. And then launching them, that was pretty cool, like pushing the button and like seeing how far they went. The rockets were really cool. The first time we shot ours, it didn't go as high as we wanted. So then we got to shoot it again and it went super high. It was so fun to see. The best I've done like before this was those water rockets where you stomp on them and they go like, doop. So it was really cool for me to see them go so much higher. I have three careers that I want to do. Biomedical engineering, mechatronic engineering, and design engineering. As far as engineering is concerned, it'd be really fun to be a test engineer or one of the engineers that design spacecraft. The average number of females or percentage of females getting bachelor's degrees in engineering has only peaked at about 20.5 percent. And in the workforce, the numbers have gone up continually since 1995, but again, still only about 28 percent of workers in the industry are represented by women um, of all ethnicities. So that right there tells me there's a need. Northeast Ohio is the number one supplier to Boeing and Airbus of aircraft parts and equipment. It's a $3.2 billion industry. We can draw the students in, we can train them, we can educate them, and then we can kick them out the door and there's jobs right here in this area, which is kind of cool. You know, middle school, you're probably not thinking about it, but even at that short thing, it's, it provides them an avenue and something that they can say, hey, I might be able to do this and there's a place that I can go to do it.